This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN, headline news update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien, coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 2 p.m. Eastern time on Thursday, two hours left to go in the trading day. And we got markets in negative territory, a little bit of a bounce off the bottom, though. Right now, S&P is negative by seven points, trading at 29.15. You get the NASDAQ right now, negative by 25, trading at 8,024. Dow Jones, negative 153 points, trading at 26,275. Jumping over to commodities, quite a day to the downside for gold and oil. Gold off almost almost $12, $12.72.30, oil off $2.15, trading at $61.44. And on the heels of the Fed meeting yesterday, we got bonds with lower price, higher yield, 10-year note, negative 12 ticks, 123.06, 30-year bond, negative 21 ticks, trading 146.30, and that dollar index up 135 ticks, trading at 97.545. Let's jump over to the futures markets. We'll start it off with the Dow. So I back things up a bit on these charts just to give some perspective of where we were yesterday afternoon coming into the Fed meeting that started kind of the run to the downside. So you had the Dow noon yesterday, about 26 hours ago, trading at almost, we'll call it 26,650. So we're a solid 400 points off that level, even though in context, we reached a low this morning of 26,157. So 80 points off the low, but still 400 points in the Dow negative from where we were yesterday. S&Ps backed it up as well. We were trading at 29.54. We're now a solid 40 points below that level. We made it down to 29.01, so quite a quite a run to the downside, but still 40 S&P points in that one day. NASDAQ 100, it was quite a slide yesterday in that NASDAQ 100. We went from 78.63 down to 77.36, made it back above 7,800 briefly this morning. NASDAQ then under 7,700, currently trading 77.24. There's your crude contract, quite a trade to the downside, 61.48. Gold contract, quite a fall off, so we had a spike higher on the actual Fed decision at two. When Chairman Powell started his press conference, the market did not like what they had, he had to say. You trade from 12.88 all the way down to a low this morning of 12.67, gold trading at 12.73. Stay tuned, folks. We got a man, Dave White, coming up right now at the Power Trading Hour. And of course, Tom O'Brien wraps up live from 3 till 5. We get the jobs report tomorrow morning. That'll be interesting. See what happens. I'm sure they'll have plenty to talk about. Stay tuned, folks. Dave White coming up right now.